Well, I did a project where I, I live in Ithaca, New York, on the southern tip of Cayuga Lake, right? And I know many of you have been over there in the Finger Lakes region. I'm sure it go, driving across there. And if you haven't, it's beautiful. There are 11 Finger Lakes, uh, north and south, carved out by glaciers. And I did a project a um, you know, long while ago, uh, maybe 12 or 15 years ago, uh, where I traveled up and around all 11 Finger Lakes for a year. I was like, what do I want to do when I grow up? I want to be Woody Guthrie. I want to travel around and meet people and learn and then write songs based on what I've experienced. And so I did that for one year. It was a project that was sponsored by an organization, uh, the Community School of Music and Art there in Ithaca. And I traveled around up and down all the small towns around the Finger Lakes region of New York. And I interviewed them and I met them. And then I wrote original songs based on the people that I met there. And um, 11 Finger Lakes. Um, I spent almost the whole year at the Middle Finger Lake. Um, and if you go down from the Middle Finger Lake down to Elmira, New York, that's where I met my good friend Dina Jacobson. And Dina Jacobson lived until she was 92 years old, and I got to know her and her daughter, Connie, and I wrote a song based on her life, and we, we got to know each other quite well over a number of years, five or six or, or seven years. Um, and I recorded the song. I wrote the song based on Dina's life. I recorded it, and about three years later, some filmmakers called me, and they said, we've heard this song about Dina's life, and we would like to make a documentary film about your song and your connection to Dina and her life. Would you like, you know, and I was like, hell yeah, that sounds great. So they spent three years making a documentary film, and it came out when Dina was 92 years old. And at the New York Film Festival, it was premiered. And there's 500 people in the big cinema there with the big screen. And Dina Jacobson, 92 years old, was right there in the front row um, watching this film of her life and her story. And afterwards, the film was shown. And then over at the reception buffet table, she came over to me and she said, Joe, beautiful, like the song she loved. And, and she said, now the film is out. And the film, she said, I'm tired of telling my story. I'm tired of talking about how I, my story, the film is going to live on now. I'm tired of talking about how I was born in Poland, how I was in Auschwitz for three years, how I was in a displaced persons camp for two years where my daughter came, was born, and then I came across the Atlantic Ocean through Ellis Island, resettled in Elmira, New York, and she said, I'm tired of talking about this story now. The film is going to live on, so I don't have to tell this story anymore. She said, I'm done now. So I'm going to sing this song uh, uh, for her. And uh, I don't have, in terms of the world we live in right now, in Israel and Gaza and Palestine, I don't know. I just know that when you lean in and listen to people's human stories, I don't have any answers or solutions, but I do know that for me, when I lean in and listen to people's stories, uh, whoever they are, and you really lean in and you hear them, um, that it matters to them and it matters to us, and it maybe connects us a little bit more than we would be if we didn't do that. So that, that's about all I know as an artist right now to do. So I'm gonna sing this song here. Uh, it's from the perspective of Dina and uh, having a conversation with her daughter. If you go back in time when Dina was maybe 20, 26 year old mama and her little four year old daughter Connie's looking up at her, mama, where were you born, mama? Yes, my darling, yes, I used to be little just like you. Yes, I played with all the other kids too. Yes, my darling, yes, I used to be little like you. Well, darling, in a Polish town halfway around the where I lived when I was just a girl On a farm in a Polish town Halfway around the world I had you and a strong will We made our home in these New York hills You sailed with me and I sailed with you with a leather suitcase, everything 
is new? That's a good question. We sailed to America because there was a war. And when you're older, I promise I'll tell you more. My sweet darling, we sailed to America because there was a war. What's a war? Well, it's when people fight and things get really tough. That's all for now, I've answered enough. My sweet daughter, war is when things get really tough. In the New York Harbor, as the ship pulled in, I held you close, we were starting over again You sailed with me, and I sailed with you With a leather suitcase, I was 22 Yes, I had a family But some people came and took us from our farm Yes, you're right, my dear Yes, that's a tattoo on my arm I had a family But some people came and took us from our farm Still I wonder, but I don't know why I was a lucky one to leave a life sailed with me and I sailed with you with a leather suitcase and this blue tattoo Don't you go outside with the other kids and play Darling, please No more questions today And I had you in a strong wind We made our home in these New York hills You sailed with me And I sailed with you with a leather suitcase and this blue tattoo Dina Jacobson 